the other thing that I think is really striking is how general these models are. I mean, they pull structure out of unstructured data. And so it doesn't matter what field you're in, if there's structures in there, the models, and you have the data, the models can go and find it, and then you can use it. And so it's not just impacting or affecting the field of AI research, it's affecting most fields. If you look at the historical stack, and you know this as well as I do, you have the CPUs and they have an instruction set, and then there's, there's a compiler and an assembler and a linker and a loader and then a programming language. And there's all these layers that we've built to be human interpretable. And then we use tools to translate from one layer down to the other. But all those are kind of ad hoc things that we've built by hand over many decades. Mm. And I think AI is going to be able to define just completely new interfaces and just bust through them and just completely change that whole hierarchy that I got trained on and I spent 30 years trying to master. <laughs>